Our NTEP National Turf Grass Evaluation Program trials are based here in College Station, Texas. We also have some additional trials up at the Dallas Center with the Texas A&M AgriLife Research and Extension. And the primary objective for these NTEP trials is uh, to evaluate new and emerging varieties for their performance in southern and southeastern transition zone environments. So, what that means is we plant the grasses, the zoysias, the bermudas, the seashore pass palums, St. Augustine grass, grasses that we know persist and do well in the southern United States, and we evaluate them on an equal level. So we'll take, for example, in this case, the NTEP zoysia trial, uh, 30 or so different varieties, and we compare them to each other based on quality, color, leaf texture, density, uh, drought hardiness, performance, pest occurrence, and what NTEP does is they take data from this location and data from all throughout the United States at other cooperating universities and they compile that in a manner that a producer or a customer or um, anyone that's interested in planting a new variety can look and see an independent source of data to evaluate whether or not um, that grass is a good fit for their needs. So for example, we have a grass here, a zoysia, that may do great in terms of how it performs under drought. We have one next to it that may uh, look a little better, but may not perform as well under drought. So that is an important thing to understand when you're selecting a variety, because as we all know in the southern United States, drought is always an issue, it will continue to be an issue, and we certainly want to breed and to select grasses that do well in hot, dry climates. Um, one of the things we've also asked our clients here to do is place these orange flags in the plots that they feel like on their unbiased um, novice opinion what looks the best and you can see it's interesting that a lot of the flags were placed in the same plot so it just kind of goes to show that the data that we collect we try to do it in a manner that's going to be reflective upon how people are going to view these grasses when they get to their home or their golf course or their athletic field.